What's up everyone? G1 here, back again with another video. And today we're gonna open up this box that I got from Box Lunch and uh, see what Funko Pops I got. Um, I ordered this about a month ago. It came in a few couple weeks ago. I've had it for a while. So I decided it's about time to open it up and uh, see what I got. Got the unboxing knife. This is a Kershaw Blur. Love the knife. I am here in my garage studio slash workshop. Got the receipt. That side. Knife away. Some papers. And looks like they're all in little dividers or little boxes. So let's see what we got. Like I said, I don't really remember what I ordered. It's been a while, but uh, we can find out together. But here's the first one we got. Um, we got Dr. Peter Venkman from the Ghostbusters. I like this pop right here. I am a big fan of the Ghostbusters. Um, I do have Slimer. And now I got Peter. I'm gonna try to shoot for getting the whole set here soon. But yeah, let's put that one aside. Boom, we got uh, Stan Lee. I am a huge fan of Stan Lee. This is my second Stan Lee pop. I also have the, the Stan Lee astronaut one. I think the Guardians of the Galaxy. That one's a really clean one. But, uh, I thought this one was really nice. It's like the patina look. I'm not sure if you guys can, can really see that, but um, there's a little close up. I'll do some little close ups on, on each individual pop here soon as well, so you guys can get a better look. be like a special one or something oh yeah this is one I really wanted it's the Travis Barker from Blink 182 I actually met Travis Barker and uh, got his autograph on a hat of mine I'm not sure if that's focusing good or not but uh, hopefully you guys can see it mm. 
But yeah, he is probably my favorite drummer. Um, Blink-182 is one of my favorite bands. Um, he also started the clothing line, uh, Famous, and I uh, really like the clothing line as well. These boxes look really clean. Um, Box Lens did a good job of uh, packaging them well so uh, they do not get damaged. Travis Barker, man. One of the greats. See what we got here. We got Semi from Coming to America. Another awesome movie right here. There's also Prince Akeem and uh, Randy Watson. See if we can get that to focus. Hopefully I could pick those up one day. I'm not sure if they're out already or not, but um, Semi's the first one I got. Awesome looking pot, a lot of detail in this one. And once again, the box is looking clean. Yeah. Got two more left. This one's all taped up. So let's get the unboxing knife again. All right, this one is already damaged on the top as you can see. I was just giving Box Lunch some props on their packaging, but this one did not make it so well. And this is the Beverly Hills Cop Axel Foley. I actually have, uh, let's see if that's in focus. I actually have the other Axel Foley right there on the back. So I got this one to, to complete the collection. Like I said, box is damaged right there on the top, which I am a little disappointed. I wonder if I reach out to Box Lunch if they'll uh, replace that and send me a new one. If you guys know uh, Box Lunch's policy and if they'll replace that, leave a comment down below. But yeah, I am an inbox collector, so I do like displaying my pops in the box. If I do have doubles, I will display them out the box. Or if the box is really damaged, then I do display out the box as well. Axel Foley with the bananas. Yeah, one of my favorite actors right here. But not least, let's see what we got. All right, this one. This one I mainly got because I'm a Raiders fan, but um, 
Unfortunately, this guy disappointed me and probably a lot of Raider fans out there, but uh, we got Antonio Brown, or some may call him Antonio Clown because of the, the things he's been doing lately. But yeah, I was really excited about getting him on the Raiders, but unfortunately he never got to play because of all the issues he was having on and off the field. First it was with his helmet. He was complaining about having to get a new helmet. I don't know, first it was his foot. I think he had something, something happened to his foot in a, in a, in a cryo chamber, I believe. And uh, while his foot was healing, he ended up having to get a new helmet. So he had an issue with that, wanted to keep his old helmet, but it didn't um, pass safety standards anymore. So then after that, he got into it with our general manager, Mike Mayock, then recorded one of his uh, conversations with our coach, John Gruden. And then got brought up on some charges, sexual assault charges, I believe. So, um, yeah, did not last long with us. But um, either way, I wish him well. But like I said, I picked this one up because he is in the Raiders gear and I am a Raiders fan. I am also looking to try to get the Derek Carr Funko Pop. for the background noise like I said I am in my garage and could hear all the cars driving by and starting their engines up and stuff but uh so yeah these are the Funkos I got there are six of them the boxes are all clean except for the axle foley Favorite out the bunch definitely has to be this Travis Barker. I'm hoping to get Mark Hoppus. That'd be a nice addition to the collection as well. Hope to keep doing more videos like this. It's been tough trying to go to the stores with everything going on right now. So I have been ordering some pops. Haven't ordered any recently, so uh Maybe my next video I could go through my collection of Pops or something like that. Leave a comment below if you want to see my collection of Funko Pops. Oh. Luckily that's the damaged one. But yeah, those are the Funkos I picked up from Box Lunch. Hope you enjoyed this video please leave a thumbs up if you liked it, it really helps my youtube channel grow um, been trying to grow this channel uh, also hit that subscribe button for more videos like this and uh, smash that notification bell so you know when my videos are coming out so uh, I guess I'll see you guys on the next one and I'm out